What's up guys? Trizzle Trey, Triz Tech and Electronics. Today we are going to do a head-to-head -head, uh, startup speed test between the late 2012 model MacBook Pro, as you could see, and the new 2012 Retina MacBook Pro. Uh, both of them are stock. There has been nothing done to either version. Uh, they're both, you know, stock versions. Uh, the one on the left is the late 2011. The one on the right is the Retina. So let's get right into this startup speed test. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to hit the power button and the start on my stopwatch on my iPhone at the same time as you can see. So you can see how long it takes for this, the late 2011 version MacBook Pro, to get up and go. Um, as you can see, it's off to the races, but it's already up to 15 seconds now uh, and still going. I'm not going to speed this process up. I'm going to let you guys see it from start to complete finish. Uh, normally, I would, you know, let it start and then bring it back when it's finishing. But I really want you guys to see exactly how long this takes and how uh, much faster the new version is. I think you guys are going to be surprised at how drastic the difference is between these two. So here we are now at up over 40 seconds. 40.8 or 40.7, excuse me, uh, was how long it took for that to get uh, completely started up. As you can see, I have it held closer, but I also have a macro close-up image of it. 40.7 seconds with the late 2011 model MacBook Pro. Everything stock, uh, nothing added on. So with that said, let's take a look now at the new 2012 Retina MacBook Pro. I'm going to do the same thing, hit the start button and power buttons at the same time, uh, and let this thing boot up. I really, as I said, think you guys are going to be very excited at how much faster uh, this thing starts up than its predecessor. So we're up to uh, 10 seconds now, and still going, and there you go, 14.8 seconds. It is ridiculous how much faster it is. That's, uh, you know, a quarter of the amount of time it took for this to start as its, you know, not even year old predecessor. Uh, so that just goes to show you how much faster the tech, how much faster it is and how much, uh, cleaner the technology is uh, with the new model. So that's all for this video. There's going to be some more speed tests to come here in the very near future. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.